Hi guys, welcome all of you in my YouTube channel, the Student Planet and Design Hub. So this is the video series of modeling commands. Uh, in my previous video, I have explained about the edit command up to uh, align command. Okay, so I hope I have explained that uh, the properties in that video, property command in that video. Okay, and. Uh, uh, in this video i will explain next some commands okay so let's start if you are not subscribed to my channel then please subscribe and uh, press the bell icon to get the notification for the next video and uh, if you are gaining something uh, from my videos then please hit like button and uh, share my videos okay so let's start uh, in setting command you generally I will explain it in uh, drafting mode okay so if you select this then uh, you can apply it with your drafting mode okay suppose that I am showing you just uh, but I will explain in deep uh, in deep in depth in uh, drafting when I will uh, go through uh, go through the drafting commands okay so suppose that i want to change then you can see here just go to the settings this one now you can change all these things from the setting commands okay i will explain all about this command uh, i will explain the drafting commands okay so in this lecture i will only dis uh, discuss about the modeling commands so let's start suppose that in next one uh, sketch okay so firstly you have a sketch to edit that suppose that i have created this finish this one then go to the edit sketch now in this way you can edit your sketch okay uh, this is a simple command you just need to go to the sketch to edit again okay you can uh, edit it directly by just uh, double clicking okay so in this command there is no uh, more thing to explain now move on the next one Preform and other curves parameter. Suppose that I have created any block. Okay, this block. Now I want to uh, you can uh, use this x form uh, x any free from command from uh, with the curves and the face also. Okay, so just uh, select the face. I have selected this. Okay now how you can use this suppose that if i will increase the degree in u and v direction then uh, more points okay you can see here more points are appearing okay so in this way i can change it poles okay now you can see if i want then i can uh, change the shape of this block with the help of suppose that this one and uh, go to the vectors vector and define suppose that this vector okay i am defining this vector and uh, pulling these points in this direction now you can see how I can it uh, change the shape with the freeform command okay you can see here you can just change your shape of your uh, face with the help of freeform okay if you will increase your degree uh, patch patch degree then you can see uh, how your points will appear you can see in u and v direction okay so this is the way 
of the free from commands how you can change the shape of your page uh, this is generally used when suppose that i want to uh, some uh, emboss type okay then i can uh, control it by the points okay by the poles so in this way you can use the free from command okay after that just need to go to the suppose that i want to do the parameter so firstly i uh, have to create some calls so for that i'm just doing this as calls okay now go to the edit command and curves then parameter suppose that i want to change the parameter of this curve then i can change it by poles okay if you will uh, close then it will directly close from the first point to last point okay uh, if you uncheck this okay and uh, want to move your points in any vector direction then you can move so that i am giving this vector and i want to move this point like this then i can move it okay so that i am giving vector in this direction then i can move this curve in this direction also okay so this is the way how you can manage your uh, curves you can see your how your curve is appearing at this time in uh, 3d dimensioning okay you can move it uh, in 3d uh, with the help of your vector okay so this is the way after that you just explain trim curve and uh, all this suppose that i am inserting some curves apply insert curve line suppose that I'm giving you sorry no problem okay after that uh, suppose that I want to use stream curve then I can trim it curve to trim okay which curve you want to trim and uh, boundary object you can specify plane object anything okay and uh, second bounding object also you can select suppose that i have selected this one and i want to apply then i can trim this you are seeing this has been trimmed okay uh, you can trim between two curves okay by assigning the second one also suppose that just a second suppose that uh, if you want to trim curve between two bound boundary points then you have to select this second one also then you can uh, trim it okay and uh, suppose that next one which command mm, curves trim trim corner if you have any corner then you can trim that so that i am giving you just insert and curve and rectangle this one okay and uh, uh, firstly to uh, trim corner we have a curve so that such type of curve which makes a corner within a radius okay so okay and then insert curve and shape curve intersection point oh it is not tracing Suppose that I'm um, 
creating yes you can see I'm creating this one yes okay in this way you can see <coughs> i have created this and uh, just want to apply the trim corner go to the here and trim corners now you need to just select at the intersection point creation come parameters of the highlighted cars will be removed do you want to continue yes you can see here this has been trimmed okay so in this way you can apply the trim corner after that go to curves and divide suppose that you have any two curves and uh, a single curve and i uh, want to divide it within two parameter curves i have two curves i will i want to uh, I split this curve into two parts uh, not two parts just split from uh, between these two parts so then just need to go to the and uh, select the divide and uh, now in equal segments and select the curve this one and uh, segment number of segments okay equal parameter and, uh, this one suppose that I just applied then you can see uh, it will um, divide into two parts okay so this is about the you can see it is divided into two parts and divide the car after that you want to edit the edit the fillet then just uh, not trim and just click this suppose that I have this fillet and I want to edit this just a second edit fillet you can edit any fillet okay I will explain it so that I stretch this one you can uh, extend it by the giving the points and you can uh, extend it by the points okay point to point suppose that I want to do this point as first one after that uh, sorry point to point first one okay and second one suppose that this one then click okay okay sorry just need to edit cars stretch this car point to point this one second one is in x and y suppose that in y i will just extend it up to 20 okay then you can extend it not extending yeah yes but you can extend it stress commands uh, it is like a stress command okay, okay. Uh, suppose that I want to okay. and delta x and delta y delta z so this is in x so just uh, get delta x as uh, 10 you can see here and this has been extended okay so this is the way you can also uh, extend it by points just go to the stretch suppose that I want to this one and point to point first point is this one and second point is 
थर्टी इन वाई डायरेक्शन ओके इन वाई डायरेक्शन आई वॉन्ट टू बी एज सपोज एट फिफ्टी ओके I hope it should work. Yes. Okay. In this way, you can extend by point, uh, point to point, and by your uh, delta x and delta y. Okay. In which direction you want to move? So this is the way. After that, curve length. Then you can also extend your curve length. Suppose that. Suppose that in this way you can extend your car how much you want, and uh, suppose that you want to extend the radius, then it will extend as like a circle. Okay. You can see here. So this is the way. After that, uh, we will edit it. Curve, and uh, then a smooth is planned. Just a second. I guess uh, now of which command I have to explain. Curve lengthen has been explained. Okay, then a smooth curve. Suppose that I have this curve, then I want to smooth it. This then need to you can increase uh, this smoothing factor. Okay, and the modification factor you can change. This will uh, affect your. Spline shape, you can see this shape is changing. Okay, you can see here this one like this. Okay, so in this way, you can smooth your spline with the help of this curvature, curvature variation. Okay, only a single for a single. This one you can increase. Okay, so this is the way how you can. Uh, smooth your curve and uh, last command uh, save by template okay template means uh, suppose that you have any curve and uh, you want to uh, shape your second one curve according to the first one so first one uh, spline first here you have to choose the spline which you want to uh, make in shape okay suppose that i want to make this and second one I uh, choose this one. Okay, now you have to. You can see here. Uh, this is uh, the shape of this comma uh, spline has been changed according to this. But you can uh, much more change your shape according to your spline. So you can see here this one like this one, this one like this one, this one like this one. Okay, so this in this way you can. You can also create a copy of the change shape. In this way, you can change your uh, the shape of your spline according to the template. Okay, you can see here. This this is the copy and uh, this is the original. So in this lecture, only up to here, I have completed this all these. Okay. So in this uh, in the next will. next uh, video i will explain some other commands okay so until the next vi video uh, take care yourself your family your neighbors okay bye bye jai hind vande mataram